Hey everybody, it's John here from thegamiac.com. Here we are today back in the Bioshock collection grabbing more challenge rooms today. Today we're doing the expert run of a shocking turn of events, which is to beat this level in under 4 minutes. As soon as the level starts, turn around and then spam the A button to activate the bathysphere uh, lever that should kill you and respawn you in this room. Hit A to leave the Vita chamber. Make sure you pick up the shotgun, the bullets, and then both first aid kits. Exit the room by hitting the lever, quickly hit up on the d-pad to switch to electric ammo, shoot the electric lever to open up the second door, grab the first aid kits and the eve hypnos from there, then jump down, grab this eve hypno, and then you want to go over here in this corner, loot this dead body for the trap bolt, that's very important. Make sure you grab the first aid kit on this table and the one right here, grab the tonic which is going to be static discharge, grab this first aid kit and then drop down to the elevator, go over here, grab this electric ammo, load it into the gun, shoot the switch, and then hit A once it's all charged up. As soon as you do that, you want to head to the left. There should be an enemy over here. You want to get him chasing after you, basically, and uh, lead him to the switch. Thanks to the static discharge tonic, if he hits you, you should poop out some electricity, which should kill him as well as charge the switch. Once that happens, make sure you uh, flip the switch, and then head to the right. Go into the room that says Grand Carnival, pick up the Eve Hypno and the Telekinesis Plasmid, switch to Telekinesis and grab a teddy bear, go over here, light the bear on fire, and uh, this should take a while, and uh, once the bear is on fire, head over here, hold the bear up to this block of ice until the ice melts, and then you want to drop the bear using the X button into the pipe, and then you want to use Telekinesis to try to pull out the electric bullets right there. And uh, it's a little tricky. You're probably going to spend most of your time on this part, simply because there's a lot of stuff in that grate. But as soon as you grab it, just head across the way, and then switch back to telekinesis, head into this room, grab the Eve Hypno, and then try to uh, open up the safe. It should be locked, and that should start sending out some trap bolts out. Use telekinesis to uh, grab one of the trap bolts and bring it over to the safe. That should overload it. You can run through the wires and make sure you have uh, enough first aid kits Bring your health back up and then head to this door, punch in the code, it's going to be 1951 and there should be an enemy in here. Make sure she's chasing after you and then head back to the switch and uh, you want to kind of uh, look back and make sure she's still chasing you because sometimes she'll get lost which will mess up the run. So uh, just make sure she's chasing you, bring her back here and then let her hit you which should uh, static discharge and charge up the thing, hit the lever and then head into the bathrooms behind the elevator to get another enemy who is going to be on the left. You can also grab that e no if you want and uh, same thing just lead this person out and bring her to the switch and get hit, kill them and then charge the thing, hit the lever and now you have to wait till this thing's actually ready. The uh, problem with this part is sometimes you might get a little antsy and then charge the thing while it's charging, which is a waste of bullets. But use the, the uh, electric shotgun blast to charge the thing and then hit the switch. Then you want to wait a while again. Uh, pull out the crossbow and then shoot the uh, lever and then run into the crossbow, which should charge it up again. And then hit the switch one last time. That should get the ferris wheel going. And then all you have to do is just wait by it and wait for the little sister come out. This took me about three and a half minutes, so about 30 seconds underneath the uh, time requirement. So you should be uh, pretty good on terms of time. Rescue the sisters and the level and you should pop your achievements. One for beating it for the first time for a five gamer score and the other one for 15. And that's all there is to it.